Welcome to this Getting Started tutorial for Top Solid 7. In this tutorial, we're going to learn how to import data as a copy via the contextual menu commands, also using drag and drop from Windows Explorer just to give you a different way of importing the data as a copy, and then after that, I'll show you how to translate the data into Top Solid. Let's see how it all works. Importing data is very simple. Let's start by using the contextual command. Here I'm going to go to the folder where I want to put a copy of the file that I want to translate for my customer. I'll right click on that folder, go down to Import Export, and I'm going to choose the option Import File Without Conversion. In this case what will happen is a copy of the Parasolid file in this case will be added to my project. What's really cool about this then is we have a constant record of all the data that we receive from our client. Now, I'm going to delete this and show you another way to do it. In this case, I just dragged and dropped it onto my recycle bin. What I'm going to do is drag over a Windows Explorer window. So here I have the file open in Windows Explorer on my D drive, and I'm just going to use standard Windows drag and drop technology. Let me minimize this a little bit to make it easier to see. I'm going to drag and drop this onto this folder. Now here, Top Solid says, hey, you just drag and drop in a file that we can translate. Do you want to translate it? I'm going to choose no in this case. And again, this is just so that I have a copy of that original Parasolid file. From there, I'm going to right click and save it into the project. And now the last trick is how you convert it. And this is as easy as it gets. It's a right click away. Just right click on the file and choose Convert Document. From here, you can validate and Top Solid will do the rest of the work and import the data from your customer.